for the other title fight that we got going on, we got Davison Figueredo, Deuce Tegueda, facing off against Baby Assassin, Brandon Moreno, who um, had a much more of a valiant performance than I think anybody really thought going into that fight. However, both of these dudes had to make weight twice within the span of 21 days. Really? And as oh, someone who cuts weight, I'm sure you know that's not an easy task. My spec- yeah. So my speculation is that there's no way you could be 100% after doing that. Is that true? That is, yeah. Honestly, um, it, it depends on like it depends on how much you're cutting. But to put your body through that 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 trauma, you know, so so close together, that's not healthy in terms of performance. Like, um, it, like I said, it depends on how much you're cutting. But you are you are depriving your body. Yeah. You know what I mean? Even if you have to cut three pounds, 10 pounds, you're depriving your body. You're yeah. putting your body through trauma. You're stressing your body out and you have to replenish. You have to do all those things. And when you when you're dehydrating your body after you um, put the weight back on, it's holding on to like everything because it's like, oh, my God, I don't know when I'm going to get this again. It has to hold on to everything. So to do that, to put your body through that, to rehydrate and then to dehydrate it again. Mm-hmm. In that short of a time, that's yeah, that's a, I think that's uh, that's pushing it a little bit yeah. for sure. And that's what makes for sure. that's what makes this championship rematch really exciting for me is because there's arguably both of those fighters weren't at a hundred percent going into the fight. Right. So like let's right. see them now that they actually got our full training camp. You know exactly. And, and it's not only just two weight cuts; it's like they fought people two. You know, twenty one right. days prior. It's going to be mm-hmm. crazy. But with all that context aside, who you got? Honestly, I don't know much about both of them, mm-hmm. if I'm being honest. Um, yeah, I know uh, I saw what Brandon, uh, one of Brandon Moreno's fight. Didn't he fight Brandon Royval? He yeah. fought him. That was that that's fight he, right before. Yeah. That was that fight. Okay. So I saw that. I don't know much about the other dude, just being yeah. honest. Sure. So you're going to have to give me a little bit of, I'll you have to you, give me a little bit on that. So Deuce Together, he's just this dude who, so you're talking about depends on how much he cut. He cuts a lot. This dude is big and everyone he touches, he starches, right? He knocked out Joseph right. Benavides and then rematched him and submitted him in the first round, right? Like he's that type of dude, you know what I'm saying? Where if he puts his hands on you, he puts you to sleep, unless your name is Brandon Moreno. Um, okay. Dude, he got the God of War, red stripe in his hair, you know what I'm saying? Oh, he, that's him. That's yeah, him. Okay. Yeah. yeah, yeah so okay. just you know it, so maybe you could now feel what it's like once again to be uh you know one of these casual fans once you know what i mean yeah. not be too yeah. invested right who you got just on a casual perspective people throw out they picks all the time you get to do the same here who, who's it gonna be uh i'm gonna have to honestly okay i love i love brandon Reynolds' style but i'm gonna have to go with other dude just yeah. based off now knowing his face and like kind of seeing some of his remembering some of his performances i think i'm gonna have to go with him honestly uh but we're going to see. Yeah. Don't quote me on it. We're going to see. <laughs> no, I'm with you. I'm I'm completely split on it, too, because it'd be big for Moreno. He would be the UFC's first full-born right. Mexican champion. And yeah. uh, this dude, he just has a great personality. Sometimes that's the thing you root for, right? You're like, you're just such a yeah. nice guy. Right? Like, yeah. Yeah.